what is that rational numbers? We have to multiply that rational numbers with 5 by 2 and uh, we have to add a 2 by 3. Okay. After multiplying we have to add 2 by 3 and the result that will be a minus 7 by 12. Minus 7 by 12. So let's take that rational numbers. Let x be the rational numbers. Now, according to the information, information says, okay, so this rational numbers is multiplied with 5 by 2. According to the information, so x is multiplied with 5 by 2 and add and add it 2 by 3 and add it 2 by 3. The result that we get is minus 7 by 12. The result that you can get is that is a minus 7 by 12. That is the question says. Okay. So, can we take this uh, constant number into my uh, right hand side? So, this one becomes a negative 1. So, x into 5 by 2. X into 5 by 2. Minus 7 by 12. Minus 2 by 3. See, denominator is not same. So, we have to make the denominator same. It means we have to take the LCM 12 and 3. That is 12 only. LCM is 12. So, it means we have to make the denominator same. It means we are making by this 3 denominator as a 12. So, we have to multiply with which numbers so that I am getting over the other 4. So, 4 is are 12. So, if I multiply in denominator with 4, so I have to multiply with the same digit in a numerator also. So, over 4, 4. So, 4 to the 8 and 4 to the 12. So, x into 5 by 2. So, minus 7 by 12 minus now you multiply with the 4, 4 only. So, 8 and 12. Okay, 8 and 12. Now my denominator is same. So, I can directly subtract or add. So, 2 and this carry minus 8. Here are x into 5 by 2. So, x into 5 by 2. So, what? Minus 15 upon 12 minus 15 upon 12. So, write this fraction or write this fractional number into a little simplest form. Simplest form it is if anything is common, that's cut it out. So, we know that 5 3 are and 5 sorry, uh, 4 3 are. And uh, the 3 3 gets cancelled. So, what left is 5 and 4 left? Uh, then 5. 3 are 4 3 are. So, 3 3 gets cancelled. X into 5 by 2 minus 5 by 4. Now, see, we want to find the value of X. So, take this, uh, take this X formation that is 5 by 2 into my right hand side. So, both are in multiplication. So, my uh, denominator goes into the numerator and numerator goes into the denominator. So, x equals to minus 5 by 4 in multiplication because both are in multiplication. So, 2 by 5. 2 by 5. So, this 5 and 5 cancels. This 2 and 2 cancel and the 4 and 2 cancel and 2 is left. What left over here is? Minus 1 upon 2. X equals to minus 1 upon 2. So, that fraction is 1 minus 1 half. So, 
that rational number is minus one half. That rational number is minus one half. So 3 into 
thousand. So that is uh, three thousand. That is three thousand. And is ten rupee moles. That is uh, that is five x. So five thousand. So Now, 
Solve this one. See here, both sides 
start on one side and a constant pass on my other side. Okay. So the solution. See, here is two x minus three. X plus two. That is given. Now take this three into right hand side part. Okay. When you are doing interchange, the place of numbers or digit or variable. Okay. If see, we know that there are two terms over here because each terms are separated. It can be separated with a negative sign or a positive sign only. No multiplication. Here it is a one term only. You cannot say this one is the two because two and x both are in multiplication. There is no negative uh, positive sign or negative sign over here. Okay. So see, if two terms are if terms are given. And we just interchange the terms to equal sides. Okay. Now I am just taking this minus three into my right hand side. It means we have to change its sign also. So here is negative one in our right hand side part. It means to the equal to side it becomes a positive. If this three is my positive, then it becomes again a negative over there. So two x. Take this three into the right hand side part. So right hand side part means just right as it is. So it becomes plus three x. Okay. Now similarly, now we are taking a right hand side part into a left hand side part. So again, my x is positive. Okay. So if I am taking this part into the right hand side part, so this will become the unit. So two x minus x. What left is two plus three. Now we can subtract it because the degree of this variable is same. What one one? Okay. So the, uh, that is x, and the sum is five. So x equals to five is the answer. Now question. Solve one more question. That five uh, x plus Seven by two is equals to three uh, by two x minus fourteen. Three by two x minus fourteen. See. Again, it's very easy. Take variable part on my uh, one side and the constant part on the other side. See, five x. I'm taking this seven by seven by two. In my right hand side part, it means to the equal to sides. Okay. So this one is the positive one. It becomes a negative. So three by two x minus forty minus seven by two. Now take this three by two. Or on the left hand side, this one is the positive. It becomes negative. So five x minus three by two x. What left is? Minus fourteen minus seven by two. We get to get the signs. Now, your denominators are not same. Observe this part. What left? Uh, what is the denominators in fourteen? That is one. So one and two both are not same. It means we have to take the LCM. Okay. So take the LCM. See, doing the same thing only. One and two. The LCM is two only. It means we have to uh, write a uh, two. In denominator, it means we have to multiply two in numerator also. Okay. So minus fourteen into two divided two minus seven by two. Again, here also nothing is given in denominator. We have to take the LCM that is one only. So five x into two divided two minus By two into x. Okay. So what left is ten x minus three x. We know we need to say we can write it in one. So minus twenty eight minus seven divided with two divided with two. So ten. Uh, This two gets cancelled. This two gets cancelled. Why it's getting cancelled? Because I'm taking this uh, two into my equal side. It means over here. So this two and two gets cancelled. Okay, so the, this two both cancelled. So what that is? Seven x equals to the minus thirty five. So x 
by 7 what that is minus 5 so x equals to minus 5 that is the answer ok now we are going to solve one exercise question ok one exercise question Question number 16 and exercise 2.3, question number 2, 3, 4 and 5. 